Schwarzenegger just proposed a brilliant solution to the child camp crisis. Donald Trump's regime is kidnapping children along the Mexican border, separating them from their families, and caging them en masse in concentration camps. It's nothing less than a state-sanctioned system of child abuse. The stunningly cruel policy has two objectives, terrorize people of color to such a degree that other immigrants are deterred from trying to enter the United States and to create a bargaining chip for Trump to use in his endless quest to build a completely useless, completely wasteful border wall. The Trump administration is holding these children hostage and attempting to use them to manipulate Democrats into agreeing to his demands. Republicans are refusing to take appropriate action because many of them believe their voters don't care about the suffering of non-white people. Luckily, the vast majority of the country stands opposed to the horrific family separations, and outrage is building. Now, famed actor and former Republican governor of California Arnold Schwarzenegger has stepped forward to condemn Trump's sadism. Schwarzenegger took to Twitter to point out that he himself is an immigrant and as such uniquely poised to talk about what it's like to move to this country and what the United States means to him. He conceded that border security must be addressed and the broken immigration system fixed, but that kids absolutely should not be used as pawns by politicians. He said that if anyone belongs to remain in a cage until our immigration process is fixed it shouldn't be children, but the politicians who refuse to do their jobs. The image of Trump and his facilitators behind BRS is especially tantalizing and not too far beyond the realm of possibility. Hopefully, this war on children convinces America to kick the GOP out of office and wrest control of Congress from the president's lapdogs. Then, not only can we end this heinous war on children, but we will stand poised to take appropriate action when special counsel Robert Mueller releases his findings. Perhaps, in the end, Trump will be thrown in the cage he belongs.